this is Free Singles Monday today. I should tell us all about the Dark Lord Baltimore. <laughs> so, if you want to learn how to do this look, stay tuned. So, first, I started to block my eyebrows and applied my latex bald cap. After that, I'm going to get my spirit gum and apply my prosthetics. I did this by sculpting and molding it on my face cast. There are a lot of YouTube tutorials available, but don't worry, I'm gonna do my own soon. And to blend the edges, I'm going to get my Graftobian Scar Wax and I'm going to saturate the edges again with four coats of liquid latex. And after blending all the edges, we will now proceed to the foundation and I did that by mixing Snazzaro Clown White, a small part of Black Snazzaro Watercolor, and Skin Tone Foundation to achieve that pale tone. Then I'm going to apply a cream skin tone foundation around the eyes. And to emphasize the details on the forehead, I use a thin brush and black snazzle watercolor and blend it with a clean brush. I also did some details on the nostrils, the sides of the nose, and laugh lines. I also use the foundation that I mix to blend the lines more easier. And using a black eyeshadow, I'm just going to emphasize some details on the upper crease and around the eyes. And for the lips, I just use a natural color. 
and after that I'm going to get my thin brush and black snazzery watercolor face paint and I'm going to draw the veins around the head, the cheek and the chin and I'm going to blend all those lines with a clean brush. And using a black eyeshadow, I just emphasize some details around the eyes and temples. And I emphasize the chin and the jawline using the same black eyeshadow. And I'm almost done. I'm just going to paint my neck. And I'm going to pop my Batis Grey contact lenses, courtesy of Guishop.com, get my wand, put on my costume, and paint my hands. And I'm all done! Hope you enjoyed this video and if you do, don't forget to like, share and of course subscribe.